you know, taking my music to the next level, you know, pretty much, you know, for me will be a successful album. And, you know, the songwriting definitely is big for me, but, you know, there's a whole different uh, section in this career. Uh, me as an artist, so this is the start of, of a new journey. And making a name as a songwriter is big, uh, but this artist thing is, uh, is definitely important as well. And, you know, somehow they go hand in hand, and I want people to recognize that. I've written a lot of records for a lot of people. My biggest record to date is Knock You Down by Kerry Hilson featuring Kanye West and Neo. I think Kerry's dope, man. I think um, she's also doing, you know, something that I want to do that I'm in the process of doing. And, you know, uh, you know, she was known as a songwriter, and now she's an artist, but still a songwriter. Family. So if you guys say that you have something you want me to hear, lay right. my ears on, and then furthermore, you say you have something special, then gotta I'm make gonna, that happen. Gotta make it happen. But I, I always know it's great anyway. And when I heard it, I was like, yeah. You know what I mean? But um, she's really dope, man. And working in the studio with her is cool. She's. Uh, she can sing <laughs> flat out, and so it's pretty easy, you know what I'm saying, when we're in the studio or whatever and we're recording with her. She makes it pretty easy, and she's a, uh, she has a very good spirit um, and humble, you know what I mean? And so it just makes everything way easy. So good, 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 so good. Looking like, like Michelangelo. <laughs> Danger, you know, uh, super producer, man. Um, he's produced a lot of different things, man. Definitely feel fortunate to be on his team. You know what I'm saying, um, and to have him at my disposal, and <laughs> and to kind of, you know, whenever he's playing something, have the option to be like, "What you doing with that?" So you know, definitely blessed, man. And you know, I just try to, you know, make sure that I'm doing what I'm supposed to do, and you know, on my end, creatively, to make sure that I'm matching what he's doing, and you know, that we continue to push each other to keep getting better and take this thing further. I've known and worked with the runners for a long time. You know, we around the same age and we kind of got a lot of things in common, even outside of the studio, you know what I'm saying? And we, you know, we kind of think the same way with a lot of different things. And so I feel like that makes the, the energy and the chemistry in the studio uh, even better. Yeah, it's DJ Khaled live that we the best studio. And I'm here to let you know that I co-signed AC, a.k.a. Kevin Cossum. And I ain't taking no talk back. Kevin Cossum. Um, this new project is probably going to be one of the standout R&B R &B projects of the year. Man, I didn't work with him a couple times. And actually, he's like one of the fastest dudes when it comes to like finding a melody. And like just putting the words to it is always the dude that we go to and be like, look, man, you know, you gotta find, you gotta find a melody in this. Kevin's dope. He's definitely one of the greats, up and coming. You gonna see. It. 
I've been, you know, go, chasing this dream for a while. Well, I, I haven't really had that many moments to sit and, you know, think about what, what I've done thus far just because I see so much, uh, I, I just have so many things in, in, in my head that I want to do and accomplish. And you know what I'm saying? Okay. You feel? Because this is still... It's still in the vibe, yeah. Yeah. All the pretty girls, put your hands up, put your hands up. All the pretty girls, put your hands up, put your hands up. All the pretty girls, put your hands up, put your hands up. I want to see this is my favorite. Yeah, you like my favorite. Might I ask you to put your hands up? At the end of the day, you know, I just feel like, you know, um, we have to just show them and, you know, they have to see me in that capacity, you know, me as an artist, me in action. And I've always had this feeling that, you know, you just do, do good stuff, do good music, do good work, and it'll be recognized. It's I think that's the main thing, you know, people re recognizing me, whether I'm singing a song or somebody else is singing a song. No one can, you know, deliver me better than me. I'm saying there's a certain place that I want to be, and I can't even really tell you <laughs> exactly where that is. Um, you know, I think kind of when I get there, I might feel you know, wow, I've done a lot of different things or whatever, or, you know, even with the Carrie Hilson thing and the Knock You Down and, you know, having a number one record, you know, I, I just feel like nothing is guaranteed in this game. And, you know, I don't definitely want that to be my only number one. And so, you know, as much as we celebrate it, you know, I try to, you know, be happy with it and, you know, kind of pat myself on the back, but move on as fast as possible because there's so many other things that I want to do. I'm on my way Just going out to every home